on our way up, we seen nothing but fire on both sides of the road. There's still hot spots everywhere. Um, our house where we live is completely leveled. There's trees all over the driveway, all over the roads. Yeah. Um, you can barely make it up Highway 22. There's trees on the road that some had a lot of fire on the road too. House is still burning on the road. Yeah. yeah. And and Cindy, you had said that like between you said lions and gates. I mean, what what did you see between lions and gates? I mean, I didn't count, but there's 30 plus homes that are just gone, just completely burned and destroyed. I was not ready to to see that on both sides of the road. There's some houses that are still standing, um, but. For the most part, just everything along 22 is just gone. Um, we were happy to see, though, in Mill City, Giovanni's, um, Papa oh, Al's, wow. Subway, um, those Rosie's, Rosie's Coffee, Coffee House was still there. All those buildings were still standing. Yeah, we did lose Kelly Lumber, which is very sad. It's been a, a landmark for a long time. Yeah, I know um, right now officials are still trying to figure out ways to, um, you know, get up there, assess the damage. Um, today and into the coming days, um, but what what would you want people who are not living in this area who might be wondering kind of the same as you guys What's going on? I would wait. It's still very dangerous going down there The, um, air, the air quality is so bad. It is so hard to breathe I wouldn't recommend going up and if you do go up they say enter at your own risk. They are not coming to rescue you so I wouldn't do it Oh, and and even even though you guys lost your home, uh, your your father um, yeah, lost Brian his home. lost his home. You said, and now what? You guys are packing into an RV, yep. right? Yep. We're we staying. just bought a motor home on Friday, and we're putting it to use. <laughs> Seven adults in a thirty-three foot motor home. And yep. you were and you were saying, despite all that, you're still just grateful. Yes. Yeah, very happy. Yes. Everybody's healthy. We've got all of our animals, mm -hmm. our our cat, and both all of our dogs. So we're, there, it could be so much worse. Yeah, we, I'm thankful that we have an RV to go live in. There's lots of families that didn't even have that, that I can imagine having little kids and trying to figure out where to, to go would be horrible. Wow. Yeah. And when it's time to start rebuilding, I plan on helping a lot of people rebuild. I hope that the community will come together because there's going to be a lot of families that are going to need help. Yep, a lot. Okay, well, thank you so much, yeah. Brian and Cindy. Sorry to hear about your home, but I'm glad that you guys have each other. Yep, thank and we you. are safe. <laughs>